had a wonderful two days. You just need to see the amount of energy, the amount of excitement. Most of the talks were about what's the latest evidence in changing your practice, designing your practice in a way that is patient-centered, integrated, and it really brought back the principles of what this review is all about, which is clinical-led and evidence-based. The nice thing about this is, is what, what's unique here is it's bringing all clinicians into one room. So the, in, the, in the maternity group, you know, you have the midwives, you have the docs, you have all the allied healthcare professions involved in designing that pathway. You go to the acute group, major discussions on stroke, major discussions about how we're going to improve access. You go to the well-being group, what are the challenges over the next decade? You know, childhood obesity, big theme. You go to the mental health group, how do we integrate care between primary and mental health trusts? It's interesting because all of them say, we have these virtual boundaries, but the patients doesn't see these boundaries, but we do as clinicians. We created them and we keep talking about them. Review is on track. I mean, what's, what's encouraging is the last two days because there's so much work that's been done already. There's so much work which has been captured today. And they're gonna go back. They still have a couple of more meetings. At the same time, we have captured what they feel are the obstacles in the system, what are the enablers to make things happen, which I'm taking back to Whitehall and see whether we can help them overcome some of these difficulties they're having. It's been extremely positive. I mean, that's, it's, 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 it's a very unique experience, this, for the NHS. Is, is, you know, we're talking about clinical models of care. It's led by clinicians. We're talking about evidence base. And that is what the NHS is all about.